Well, good morning, boys and girls, and it's so nice to tune in with you this morning. So today, we're going to talk about something that's very important, and it begins with a W. Any guesses? That's right. We're going to talk about wisdom. And uh, so today, we're going to turn in our Bibles to 1 King um, chapter 3, and we're going to read for verses 4 to 15. It talks about Solomon, uh, how Solomon asks for wisdom. So what does wisdom mean? What do you guys think that wisdom means? What do you think? All right. So yeah, I would describe wisdom as to know what the Father's will is. What does that even mean? Well, to know what the right thing is to do and, and, and the right time to do something. Um, it's finding out what God wants you to do. Um, Solomon does a really good thing and he asks God, he asks God, this is really cool guys, he asks God for wisdom. Have you ever asked God for, for, uh, for wisdom? I know I have. We need wisdom. We do. We need to know what the right thing is to do and we need to know what God wants us to do. It's so important boys and girls. So I'm going to let you and your family, we're going to do a little different today. I'm going to let you and your family read 1 Kings chapter 3, 4 to 15, and it talks about Solomon, such a wise man, young fella. Solomon asked for wisdom. And I want to just briefly discuss what the Bible story is about. Can we do that today? All right, so God offered Solomon anything. So God, God said, Solomon, whatever you want, I want to give it to you. Whoa, that, that's pretty huge, boys and girls. If God asked you, hey, Johnny, I want to give you something, anything you want, what do you think, what, what would it be? What do you want? Well, let me tell you. Had God given the same offer to other kings of this day, those kings would likely have chosen land or gold, maybe soldiers, palaces, horses, and other worldly goods. Yeah, they probably would have. But Solomon, guess what he chooses? What do you think? He chooses wisdom. That's right. Because he wanted to be a good king. Wow. That's really wise. Um, his choice made him not only a great king, but also a wise teacher. Hmm. Interesting, boys and girls. Kings and queens from around the crown world came to visit Solomon and to learn from him. God, e God even blessed Solomon with riches beyond his imagination because you know why? Because of his wise choice. Wow. But Solomon knew that all the treasure in the world was meaningless compared to knowing the Lord and his writings. He argues us to seek the same treasure that he did. Isn't that amazing? Young Solomon, here we see a young fella, could have had anything in the world, but he chooses wisdom. Amazing. Such an amazing story. And God really blessed him for his choice. He really did. So today, boys and girls, pray for wisdom. Pray for godly wisdom. God would show you um, what is right, what is wrong, what his will is. That's so important. So I really want to challenge you with that today. Our memory verse. Do you guys remember what the memory verse is? Remember? All right. It goes like this. For where your what is, for where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Matthew 6 and 21. So the things we think about, the things that we treasure in our hearts, that's, that's where our minds and our well-beings is going to be. We need to focus on Jesus. Put Jesus first in all we do. All right, boys and girls, it was so good to tune in with you today. We have a special guest for you um, coming up, so just stay tuned. Well, good morning, boys and girls. It's so nice to see you this morning. So Mrs. Crozier was talking about Solomon. Wow, he is such a wise young fella. I want to be just like him, asking for wisdom. You know, every day I wake up and I ask Jesus, for wisdom. We all need wisdom, don't we, boys and girls? Yes, we do. So seek, seek God, seek wisdom, and you will be successful in anything you do. I like that. For where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. 
Isn't that good, boys and girls? Matthew 6 and 21. So, boys and girls, today I want to remind you, you know, open up your word, your Bible. Seek God. Pray to Him. Talk to Him. That's what being wise is all about. All right. So, next week is Easter. Oh, you know, that's a busy, busy time for me. I'm getting ready in the kitchen for our big Easter meal. Oh, making bread and preparing meats and lots of pies and desserts. Oh, Krista and her family, they love Easter. They love to eat. And it makes me, keeps me busy, boys and girls. So, you know, next Sunday um, is Easter. Make sure you know you go to Good Friday service at 1030. And then on Sunday, I heard Mrs. Crozier saying that she's got a special time prepared for all the boys and girls for Easter service. Uh, so it's going to be a good time, boys and girls. So make sure you come on Sunday, April the 17th at 4 o'clock in the afternoon at the Kingston Standard Church. Krista has a special time prepared for you. So we'll see you soon. And remember, be wise. Bye, boys and girls. All right, boys and girls. So I want to bring a couple of announcements to you. Um, I want to remind you that our Good Friday service is going to be awesome. And we're going to have a combined service with the Kingston Standard Church. And it's going to happen on Friday, April the 15th at 1030 in the morning. So get up and get ready. And let's have a beautiful Good Friday service together. All right. And then on Sunday... Uh, Sunday, April the 17th, that's Easter Sunday, woohoo, at 4 p.m., we are going to have a special kids program together. We're going to do some crafts together. We're going to maybe do um, a, a treasure hunt. Um, and then we're going to have a special Bible story, a special Easter Bible story, and we're going to have a great time together. And again, so that's going to be on Sunday. April the 17th at 4 o'clock p.m. We are going to meet together and we're going to have a blast, okay? And that's at the Kingston Standard Church. So I hope to see you guys um, there. So stay tuned. We have a special visitor um, going to appear here. All right. We'll see you in a little bit.